All right, let's film this bitch so I can eat my Chinese food. Self-doubt is something we've all faced. Are you sure you wanna wear that shirt? It is so ugly. It's that annoying voice inside your head that's trying to convince you that you're not good enough. I don't get why you're still playing that game. You're never gonna beat it. And if you're anything like me, you're going to think that it's always right. You sure you wanna post that video? It's not even that funny. This could become a real problem though, because if you allow this mentality to consume your entire life, chances are you're not going to get anything accomplished. In fact, you're setting yourself up for failure before you even have the chance to succeed. I've had those moments where I felt so trapped in my own mind when I was working on something that midway through, I just completely just gave up and allowed the very thing that I was working on to become the exact pile of shit that I originally feared that it would become in the first place. That's what we call a self-fulfilling prophecy. I've learned though how to control this mentality and I know it's going to sound completely ridiculous, but I've learned to use my own self-doubt as motivation in order to push myself to prove myself wrong. Did you follow that? It's like adopting that whole my haters are my motivators kind of mentality, except the only haters in this scenario are your own subconscious fear of failure and your own misbelief that you can't succeed. So the next time you're trying to get something done, make it a point to prove to yourself who is a boss ass bitch. That's you and own the crap out of whatever the hell it is that you're trying to accomplish. If you do end up failing, that's totally fine. You can learn from your mistakes and make sure that you come out on top next time around. But as long as you go into any given situation with a positive attitude, you're more likely to succeed. To quote the classic Hilary Duff masterpiece, A Cinderella Story, never let the fear of striking out keep you from playing the game. Because if you choose not to try at all, you're eliminating any possible opportunity for success. So go out there, conquer whatever it is you're trying to accomplish, and prove your own self-doubt wrong. If this video helped you at all or motivated you in any way, give it a big ol' thumbs up. Comment down below on how you overcome your own crippling self-doubt. I know, I have it too sometimes. Subscribe to this channel for more videos like this, and until next time, I will catch you later, nerds. I don't even know if I was in focus that entire time. I forgot to check because my Chinese food came and I moved. I'm sweaty too. Oh well.